All right, now for my next story. Recently, the trailer for the hit Max series, Winning Time, The Rise of the Lakers Dynasty, put out the official trailer for season two, which airs August 6th. That's a week from Sunday. Of course, it's the docuseries about the 1980 Showtime Lakers as they were ascending from the sh from the shadows of the Jerry West era into the Magic and Kareem era where they went on to win five NBA titles in the 1980s, anchored by, of course, Magic Johnson and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, as well as Michael Cooper, um, A.C. Green, as well as Spencer Haywood, Jamal Wilkes, Norm Nixon, whose son, um, oh, I got his name right, Trayvon, plays Norm Nixon here in the TV series. And also, there's great great performances by John C. Riley as Jerry Buss. Also, Jason Siegel plays Paul Westhead. Adrian Brody plays Pat Riley. And this season is going to focus more on the aftermath of the 1980 NBA title as well as Bird ascendance here in the NBA as he wins his first championship the year after Magic wins his and also shows the Lakers' internal issues that Magic Johnson had with Paul Westhead at the time that led to his firing as well as to the promotion of Pat Riley. Also, Michael Chiklis, who played in shows such as The Shield, one of my favorite shows, and another favorite show I loved as a kid, The Commission. He plays, well, he played Red R back in season one. He's going to have a bigger role here in season two as the Lakers and Celtics rivalry really starts heating up as they both end up on a collision course to, to prove who's the best. Also, it's going to go in depth into Magic's longtime contract that he signed back at the time with the Lakers, which was a very lengthy contract at the time for an NBA player. Also, it's going to start showing the internal strife between Jeannie Buss and her brothers as they try to fight for their own stake of the team. Jerry Buss wants to leave a legacy for all of them, but the Suns want to fight her for it, and they think she can't run the team by herself because she's a woman. But I definitely enjoyed this trailer. This is going to be a fun season. I can't wait to see what unfolds here in this season. And all the storylines. Now, look, I know all of it is not going to be true. Some things are left out for dramatic purposes or just for time reasons. But I definitely like season one. I enjoy the performances, especially of, you know, Solomon Hughes and hope I get his name right. Quincy Jack. Well, matter of fact, let me make sure I get his name right. The guy who plays Magic Johnson. Quincy Isaiah's Magic Johnson. Both of them do, do have done a great job of portraying those two. They definitely have their personalities, their cadence, their walks and attitudes down packed. Those guys definitely deserve some award recognition. But definitely like the trailer for season two of Winning Time. Definitely can't wait to see it. When it comes out August 6th, I definitely will watch the first episode. As a matter of fact, every Monday on this show, I will be giving you, <clears throat> excuse me, I will be giving you recaps of each episode, tell, giving you a summary, also giving my thoughts on the episode. Just excited for season two to finally come back. Been waiting for a long time and definitely cannot wait to see season two of Winning Time. I think it's going to be a very good season. Definitely can't wait to see the rivalry between Bird and Magic unfold, the whole Celtics and Lakers rivalry unfold. If y'all haven't checked out this show, y'all missing out. This is a pretty good show. I know some of y'all diehard Laker fans may not may not like it because y'all feel it's not a hundred percent accurate. But what it what biopic or docudrama is? I can't name one that was a hundred percent accurate. It's just a good, it's just a pretty good show. It's just for entertainment value only. Shouldn't be taken seriously. But I get why, you know, Magic, Kareem, Jerry West, and others were upset 
when the show first did, aired. The only Laker I heard really liked the show was Spencer Haywood. He definitely gave Wood Harris his props for, Wood, excuse me, Wood Harris his props for his betrayal of him. And he said he loved the show, but of course, a lot of the other Lakers of that era didn't like the show. But who knows? Maybe it might grow on them. Maybe they'll never like it. Listen up, sports fans. Your favorite sports book, BetUS.com, is back for our 28th year of NFL action. With the industry's biggest sign-up bonus of up to 200%, BetUS offers our members the opportunity to cash in on all your favorite sports, including NFL, NBA, MLB, and more. We've also got hundreds of new casino games, including the coolest new European slots, and our live dealers are waiting for you at the table. Sign up at BetUS.com today to get into the action. BetUS, where the game begins.